What is up guys, me luck here and today we're back in action taking a look at the latest Rust development update and I'm joined by that German guy and Skull. What's up guys? What's up? What's up? Um, so yeah, we got a couple new things. I guess German, uh, you want to you wanna tell us about yeah, the Yeah, um, ignore the windmill. We, we spawned it in to see if they did any changes to it. It's still invisible and useless. I mean, um, not invisible. It's, uh, pa you can pass through it. Yeah, yeah. No hitbox. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Anyway, still does nothing. Yeah, they're pretty though. But uh, the big thing is we finally got our gates, oh, and cool. look how big they are. It's kind of that perfect size for a car <laughs> to fit through, wouldn't you say? Yeah, 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 definitely. Ah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it is still the gray box or the boilerplate, if you uh, want to say either term there. Uh, it, so it doesn't have a texture quite yet, but as you can tell, it's going to be quite beautiful. And this is the wooden version. I don't know if there's going to be a stone, but this is um, like specifically called the wooden one. You can snap the stone walls to it still, and you can also build right up next to it. Uh, so you can technically use it inside of like a regular build. That would be cool. Uh, it does have a snap too, so you can see it, it works just like the walls. Um, you can snap one right next to another one. Can you see the what I'm placing right now or no? No, no. no. Yeah. Okay, but it, it does the normal snap too, and you can just kind of, oh, you know, you can cool. do something like that yeah. even. The roofs connect. Uh, the roof on it, I think, is really cool. And it does this weird kind of like electronic um, gate thing. So when you click to open it, it opens one door first and then <laughs> the other so that they don't like interfere with each other. I feel like these are what like really expensive... Um, motorized gates work so that yeah. i thought that was kind of weird i feel like the the slow moving is kind of horrible though because you're like guys there's people shooting me i need in i <laughs> yeah. need in oh my god and it's like your dad hat before the gate even starts and now and now the gates open and the enemy's coming in yeah then yeah, yeah th then you try to close it as they're rushing in and you can't um over here on this one we did put the two wooden gates on uh wooden walls onto it and uh, this one has a code lock mm -hmm. so you can code lock them so Media, you don't have the code, right? No. Okay, so try opening the gate. Nope, nothing. Yeah, so it doesn't work. I would say probably the next biggest feature is uh, the scopes. We got some holocides. Yeah, so they did quite a bit of work on uh, the weapon mods. As you can see now, it shows how many weapon mods are in each weapon with the little dots like it used to in Legacy. Mm -hmm. So the, the all guns right now have two slots. I don't know if they'll ever up that um, because I know Legacy, you could get up to six slots. On certain guns, so I don't know if they're going to do anything about that. Uh, but they added the hollow side in. The flashlight is almost finished, but it's not here quite yet. Um, but I'm sure we'll probably have it by Thursday. I'd be shocked if we didn't because it's pretty much uh, everything but textured uh, uh, from what I last saw. Yeah, I think the coolest gun here is the pistol. I have uh, both the silencer and yeah, everything. dude, yeah. that was awesome. Yeah, it looks great with this on here. Yeah, and I actually takes the, me back to the original P250s. Yeah, and then with uh, the hollow, uh, I guess the silencers now don't actually block the the iron. Yeah, no, nope, no, nope. yeah, they fixed the bolt, which is a big deal. Um, they also give a new iron sight to everything. That's a little bit better. So you've got, you know, the bolt here. I will go ahead and pull the hollow off the shotgun. Oh, dude, I like that. So with the I shotgun, it, it's the shotgun's a little weird. Because you like, I feel like you hold it lower, like you're almost shooting from your hip. I think the AK is the most noticeable new iron sight. Really, yeah. Um, it looks and feels a lot more. They, they feel, they feel like they made the all the iron sights smaller, kind of. Yeah, kind of in a yeah, way. Yeah, that's what it yeah. really did. Um, even the rocket launcher has one. I just put the rocket launcher into the modification slot. Ignore that. I don't know how that happened, but you can see here. They changed it from being like to the left. The rocket launcher has kind of a more middle. Yeah. I don't know if that it it, it it doesn't feel like it made it any more accurate, but we'll yeah. just have to see. I feel like the position of the rocket launcher is really strange too. It is, yeah. It's really up in your face. Uh, Thompson also has a new one, which I feel uh, is really nice, actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This hollow. is my favorite. You can put weapon mods on the crossbow now. Uh, silencer obviously won't connect to it. The hollow sight does, but as you can see, the hollow sight's kind of special. Um, yeah. <laughs> and it, lo it, looks, it looks fine when I'm looking at it on yours, but then like when you look down at it, it's like really strange. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm sure they'll address that before this actually releases, though. Exactly. Yeah, it's probably just a bug right now. Um, also, as you can see, they changed the weapon count to a big uh, kind of fat, bold number. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's um, a different so that's, font. And different yeah, the size. font is different uh, quite a bit. But yeah, all weapons can have the hollow sight. Uh, there's not one weapon you can't put it on. 
Well, uh, that pretty much does it for now. It was a really small update, but the gates are pretty exciting. Uh, so we figured you guys would want to see it. And uh, the holoscope was put in uh, last week, but uh, we kind of wanted to check it out in video since I didn't do an update video last week since there wasn't an actual update. Okay, guys. Well, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to go and click the like button. We'll see you guys in the next ru Rust update. And, uh, yeah, have a good day. Bye. Uh, that was like one of the worst intros.